I'm Alex Paul. It's Tuesday, July 2. Welcome to Small Cap Central. Arc Mines defines a significant new exploration target at Sandy Mitchell that has potentially elevated the project to one of the world's largest surface expressed placer rare earth projects. The exploration target estimated for Sandy Mitchell now ranges from 1.3 billion tonnes to 1.5 billion tonnes at 1250 to 1450 ppm monazite equivalent and considerably builds on the recently announced indicated mineral resource estimate of 21.7 million tonnes at 1419 ppm monazite equivalent. With its pre-feasibility study now underway, the expanded exploration target underpins the incredible scale and grade of Sandy Mitchell. While potentially simple, low-cost extraction methods are said to be put under the microscope as part of the PFS, it is Sandy Mitchell's natural advantages that are going to drive the project forward. Shares in ARC mines are up around 20% on intraday trading to 18 cents. In a world first, ASX-listed biotech tryptamine therapeutics have successfully completed a maiden dosing of IV-infused silo in a patient. The participant was administered the treatment, known as TRP8803, as part of the company's planned Healthy Human Volunteer Study, which is being undertaken by CMAX Clinical Research in Adelaide. The participant successfully underwent silicin infusion over 140 minutes, progressed well through treatment, and was discharged on completion. It represents the first crucial step of the company's clinical trial pipeline, with the potential advantages for IV-infused silicin, including a significant reduction in the onset of the psychedelic state, more precise control of the depth and duration of the experience and a reduction in the duration of the intervention to a commercially feasible time frame. Shares in tryptamine therapeutics softened today to 1.9 cents. That's all the time we have today. Tune in for more news from the small cap space by following us on X, LinkedIn, Instagram and TikTok and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'm Alex Paul and this has been Small Cap Central.